Well, what up, folks? I'm Ultrazilla, and I got some Godzilla singular point news on the movie monster series front, as well as a Japanese Blu-rays that are coming out, which comes with this guy. So what we got here is an alternate version of Godzilla Ultima with brand new uh, looking, clear looking spines, uh, fully painted. This is an exclusive, obviously. Painted mouth, open mouth. It does look really good. The rest of the body looks the same, uh, but new spines, dorsal fins, uh, and new head. Uh, this comes in a Blu-ray set for volume one of the Blu-rays. There's going to be three volumes here. And um, this first one comes with an exclusive figure. Of course, that means it's going to be pricey. What's pricey? We're looking at about 145 150 bucks. It is up at the Godzilla store right now for pre-order. I do not know if um, this is uh, going to be in other spots sometimes places like cd japan and amazon japan uh get these blu-ray sets i haven't heard anything yet it is up at the godzilla store if you want it but you'd have to get it through say zen market and order it through there and then they'll ship it to zen market and zen, zen market ships it through there it's a pretty easy process do check out zen market um but this figure does look cool except it is going to be pricey, and you do not get the full series here. You're just getting the one disc. So it's a lot of money, and um, me personally, I'm not sure if I'm going to get it. I'm going to say I'm, like, signing on the side of no right now. Uh, but, but the figure does look nice. I do have to say uh, it looks really, really cool. Um so it's one of those things where I kind of want it, but it's a lot of money. So <laughs> I don't think I'm going to get it. Uh, let's move on. We got a little bit of a spoiler for you guys in three, two, one, five, four, three, two, one. How about it? Um, not that guy. That's, uh, you know, part of the art on the Blu-ray set. But this guy is a Godzilla Territris, Territris, something like that, Tetris. <laughs> Uh, this is the next form of Godzilla, uh, up from, uh, first we had Godzilla Aquatilus, then we had Godzilla, whatever it's called. I reviewed it. I just reviewed it and I can't remember what it's called. Uh, I didn't put up that review yet, by the way. It is actually going to go up probably tonight. It's all recorded, but, uh, I haven't gotten a chance to edit it. Just FYI. And the Varen one, by the way. This is looking like Gorosaurus. He's blue. Gorosaurus was blue, if you didn't know that. Um, and uh, kind of has that similar shape. Here's the three together. And there you go. That's what it looks like. And uh, it's it's pretty cool. Well, actually, here's a better shot. This is the official pick. Um, and I think it's a good-looking figure, honestly. Better looking than the uh, last two. Yes, that's a little bit of a spoiler for my uh, review tonight. Um, but I think it looks cool. I, I really do. And uh, I'm, I'm liking that. I'm liking that. Even though, like, it looks like, even in the proto shot, the teeth look messed up. Uh, so that's not so hot. Um, actually, this sh shot here looks pretty cool. Now, th these shots come from somebody's you know, warehouse. So that must mean these figures are ready in shops, ready to be released in Japan. Uh, so do look out at all the usual spots, HLJ, Amazon Japan, Hobby Search, Ami Ami, you know, uh, for uh, availability in the coming days. Between now and tomorrow, I would assume that this is going to go up if it's coming out this weekend. And by the looks of it being in someone's warehouse, I do think it's coming out this weekend. I could be wrong about that. Could be next weekend. That seems kind of early uh, uh, for next weekend for for these things to be shown. But uh, it does look good. It does look really good. And uh, yeah, so be on the lookout for it. You guys, let me know what you think down below. Let me know what you think of the Blu-ray set. Would you be into that? 
Would you be into the figure? The figure itself looks pretty good. Do you need another Godzilla Ultima? That's the debate, right? Like, uh, when it comes to variants, that's the debate. Do I need it? Do I need an open mouth one? Um, do I need to spend 150 bucks plus shipping on an open mouth one? So, uh, because with the, with the show, you're not getting anything. You're getting like the first five episodes actually. So you, you know, nice art, but not sure if it's worth it. And that's the ultra Z new guys, news guys. I hope you uh, dug this very specific, uh, it's kind of breaking news. I mean, the news was out early, early this morning, but uh, I'm not going to put breaking news on this because it's, you know, it's already afternoon, <laughs> but there you have it till next time. Peace out peeps.